priceless memories. This is my father, look at our hair. This is Mrs. Puerto Rico, Mrs. Ramirez. And rich history. First Puerto Rican judge, Jose Vasquez. My dad said when he first came and he saw snow, he thought it was salt. If you're Puerto Rican and live in Chicago, chances are your family has a compelling migration story. But as the years tick by, those aging photos you may have that help tell those stories run the risk of being lost. There's a generation of Puerto Ricans who are passing away, and we're losing a great wealth of this information. And that's why the Puerto Rican Arts Alliance has launched an ambitious project called El Archivo, the Archive. It's a massive effort to digitize, then catalog photographs of local Puerto Rican immigrants and document the stories that go along with them. It's important for our children and also the broader public to know about the contributions that Puerto Ricans have had, not just in Chicago, but also in the Midwest. Few people are happier about this project than Joseph Ruiz of the Puerto Rican Congress on North Avenue. His father founded the group back in 1952, and for decades, priceless photos have been piling up in the group's small office, like this one of the Puerto Rican Stars, the city's first Puerto Rican baseball team, or this here, a shot of pageant contestants for Miss Puerto Rico, images that help shed light on some of the most important questions. Why we came here, and who were those pioneers that opened the doors during a time of real struggle. Unfortunately, some images have already faded to orange. We always took pictures of everything that we were involved with, but we didn't always know how to put it together or how to store it properly. Same thing for Laura Cruz, whose family has run Cafe Central on Chicago Avenue since the early 50s. The restaurant became an important hub for Puerto Rican workers when they first arrived to Chicago from the island. They all banded together and they had this restaurant. Here's a candid shot of her mother-in-law. She's serving herself coffee. This is definitely before restaurant hours, and this is in the original place. Once stories like these and the images that tell them are safely digitized in El Archivo, they'll be searchable and online for the generations. Founder Carlos Hernandez says the Puerto Rican Arts Alliance is looking for photos that were taken between 1900 and 1990 that shed light on the Puerto Rican migration experience, home and family life, social and cultural life, or life at work or in the military. We need to share it with the world. A huge undertaking, but one that Joseph Ruiz knows that his father and the other Puerto Ricans who paved the way for future generations would be proud of. My father always said, know where you've come from know where you're going, but never forget who you are. Anthony Ponce, NBC5 News.